Hi. Nope, that's, that's not gonna work. Hey, Jane. Jane. tripod. Um, ordered it a little while ago. It came in like yesterday. Cool. cool. Um, so could you just give some commentary on tonight? I'm just just giving commentary? Yeah, like like narration. Because see, I'm, I'm going to get some shots at the party and I want there to be context. So if you could be the context. Why are you filming the party? I want to film everything. Why? Um, it's kind of a long story. So basically, oh, okay. So I, I was bored in class the other day. Right. And, and I had my laptop with me. So I was just like researching some stuff. And one of the things I was researching is the top ways that people die in the US. Why? I was bored. Oh, I like God, introduced you to BuzzFeed. Wait, what? Uh, Buzz never mind. Later. Go on. Um, okay. Um, <laughs> So I was researching the way that people die, and I found out that the number six way that people die in the U.S. is from Alzheimer's disease. Okay. And and that was just, like, really horrifying. Like, if it's that common, then probably somebody we know is going to get it. And, and, like, what if it's one of us, and we forgot everything, and we, we forgot each other, and... Anyway, if we could if we could film it, and and have all the things that happen in our lives, then then we wouldn't lose them. They could, they could transcend the sickness and, and death. That's why you wanted a camera for Christmas, Sam? It's oh. a little morbid, even for you. I, it's not the only re reason that I wanted a camera. But though. largely. Yeah. And the event that you want to transcend life itself is the creative writing department's New Year's Eve party for the oh-so-auspicious year of 2015. Yeah. <laughs> One of those. Okay, okay. Then get out okay, of my okay. brain! <laughs> I have some narration to do. Hello, future dementia self. Tonight, we're going to the home of our TA, Charlotte, for a New Year's Eve party. A tiny, low-key party just for the creative writing department. I hate tiny parties because they're incredibly exhausting. Anyway, Charlotte just got back from spending a year teaching English in some developing country. She's come back for her master's, much to the chagrin of her freshman sister, Emily. Not you, amnesiac octogenarian Emily. You don't have any sisters. Sorry. The other Emily. Is it cold in here? Or is it just the massive shadow I'm in? We call her Emmy. She hates that too. I thought house parties were about providing alcohol to minors. But apparently my sister doesn't get that. Francis Scott, you have to have some booze. She kind of hates everything, actually. What's up? 